Hello, my name is Alison Moon and I'm one of the independent non-executive members of the Integrated Care Board for Bristol, North Somerset and South Gloucestershire. And I had the pleasure of chairing the board meeting today. Um, as a non-independent non-executive member, uh, my role along with five colleagues is to support the chair of the board uh, and partners who sit around the board uh, with support and challenge and some independent thinking. We're not immersed in the in the NHS day to day, so we can bring some independence of thought and thinking and and ho help. Hopefully we support and we challenge uh, in equal measure. We just, as I say, had our December meeting. It's the last board meeting of the year, and there were some really good discussions today on, uh, supported by some great papers. One of the first items I, I, I want to report on is as a board today, we noted um, a significant moment in time uh, with the announcement yesterday of University Hospitals Bristol and Western and North Bristol Trust uh, proposing to come together under a hospital group model with one chair and one chief executive. Uh, this is a really significant moment in time um, uh, as the two trusts have been working together closely for uh, for a long time. It's been clinically led, so it's about improving services for the people who use the services in the hospitals. And I think it's really important today that we noted and commended the leadership of both chief executives of the trusts, Maria Kane and Eugene Yefeli, uh, because I think it's in no uh, small part that we're in this position because of their leadership. Uh, there will be more to come on that through the Integrated Care Board. And if you want any more information on, on what they're proposing to do now, there is information on both trust websites. Next item I wanted to focus on was uh, a paper written uh, on what's called emergency uh, preparedness, resilience and response. Uh, what that means is uh, how, how good are we as a system if we had an emergency within BNSSG, our patch? And the board received a really good paper today uh, on third party assurance from NHS England that they have assessed our systems and processes and they say that there is substantial uh, uh, assurance across the ICB and all of our partners that if we were in the unfortunate event of having a major emergency, we have got the systems in place to be effective. That's good news for all of us uh, and the board really welcomed that report. The next item uh, we received was a, a paper on procurement of services. This is services that are bought on behalf of the population who use the services in our patch. Uh, it was really good to see there'd been some reflections on how previous procurement of services had gone and how we can improve them and make them of a good, uh, a consistently high standard in the future. Um, we were really pleased to, to welcome that. It's really important that we have good systems in place to spend public money wisely, and the board very much welcomed that paper today. The final paper I wanted to pull out was a paper on something called care traffic control. And this is an update on a really innovative system that we've been using for a while, which uh, monitors, monitors health demand across our all of our providers. So that's from our hospitals, our community services, uh, uh, primary care, ambulance services. And, and what it can do is it enables our staff to make more informed decisions when services in a different part of the patch are busier or, 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 or perhaps not so busy and the need to balance pressure across the services. It's very much a system that could be behind the scenes, but it's designed to make people's experiences of using the services um, more streamlined, more smooth. Again, I think there's more to be done uh, for the board to receive on that. And uh, the board really very much welcomed the, pro the significant progress that's been made to date. There were lots of great discussions today at board and you can see uh, all of that at the meeting recorded on our website plus all the papers if, if you so want to. Thanks very much. Uh, very much hope to see you at a future board meeting.